Oh, we were right. One percenters in high-tax states are getting clobbered by the president's tax reform. The top tax rate may have been cut, it was cut, but capping the deductions, well, that's what really hurt. That was always my opinion. Now it's been confirmed as fact by the United States Treasury. They audited the new tax law, looking to see who was affected and how. They found 11 million returns directly affected by the deduction cap. Those taxpayers will either pay more this April 15th or receive a much smaller refund than they used to. So less money flowing back to wealthy taxpayers in New Jersey, New York, Illinois, Connecticut, California, etc. But the money keeps flowing back to one percenters in Florida and Texas and Nevada uh, and any other states with very low taxes. You can hear the outrage. New York's governor, Andrew Cuomo, went to the White House to ask the president to, res to restore the SALT deductions. He said no. The governor is desperate. New York is seeing money and people walk out of the state. And by the way, Henderson has just replaced Reno as the second largest town in Nevada after Las Vegas. How come? Californians. They are fleeing the formerly Golden State's high taxes. And it will only get worse as the new tax law begins to bite. The Democrats' own chickens are coming home to roost. They raised state taxes, and when the president capped the deduction for those taxes, he was being fair to other states, which had not raised taxes. Why should Floridians or Texans subsidize New Jersey, New York, Illinois, and California? Why should they? Well, they're not any longer. And it's the one percenters in high-tax states who are now paying for the Democrats' love affair with taxes. That's why they're leaving.